All right, guys, welcome back to the uh, boat restoration part two. Uh, today I'm going to work on stripping the other side of the, the hole and uh, thought I'd bring you along. So let me show you what I'm using. All right, to strip the paint off of the boat, what I'm using is this uh, premium stripper. It's a gel. Uh, you just brush it on with a cheap polyester brush, let it sit for about 15 minutes, and then I'm using a pressure washer to uh, to knock it off so let's get some of this spread out and let it sit up and then we'll come back with the pressure washer and see what it does alright so you can see here what the paint looks like before you put any stripper on it and then uh, as you come on up here, once you've got the stripper on it and it's sat there for a few minutes, you can see it bubbles all up. So we're going to take the pressure washer and knock all this off and uh, keep repeating this until we've got the, the outside of the boat down as far as we want to go. All right, so now I've got the, uh, the outside of it pretty much stripped down. There is still some paint on it, obviously, but we'll do the final detail work on that right before we, we do the painting on the outside of it. But there's enough paint off of it now that I can see all the repairs that have been made and any damage that's done to the hull. And uh, we're good to go as far as that goes. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and pick the boat up and flip it back over right side up and start cleaning the interior of the boat out. And that's probably going to be a little bit more involved because they've got the closed cell foam in it and I'm going to try and get that out. So let's get it flipped over and see what the inside looks like. Alright, well I've got the boat right side up again and back on the trailer and uh, just want to show you real quick what the inside looks like before I start cleaning that out. I've already gotten all of the the old wood out of it and uh, the only thing left to do is I've got to get all this foam out that's been waterlogged and strip the side walls down so that's what I'm going to be doing next and uh, I'll bring you back when I've got something to show you on that but for now I think that's going to be all I get done today so y'all keep checking back <laughs> 